think we're good, are we? Can't tell. Let's see here. Looks like it. That all looks good. Yeah, that looks good. Okay, we should be good. Okay, away we go for today, I suppose, shall we? I suppose I should actually collect these. I don't know what it was. Okay. That's because I made that stuff. That's right. Um, it's not actually too bad. Put those away for now. I need to get some blocks, actually. We'll use dirt for today. Something easy to break. Okay. So, since last stream I've done just a tad bit with villagers down here. This wing, I guess we can consider it, it's kind of where I'm going to be making emeralds with the trading of the villagers. Sticks for emeralds, which is really good. And we got, what is it, six now? Six farmers? Finally got melons. So, um, I did upgrade my cloches upstairs. I will show you guys here in a moment. Ooh, yucca cake. That can actually be really good for us, because we have no sugars whatsoever. Uh, yeah, we'll go cut that up really quickly. Because we can use that as a good food source. So, I have... I doubled the cloches try to grow some more farm stuff because we're going to need the crops for the villagers for sure. I just have one extra that I'm not sure what I want to do yet. But we need to... Where did I put my knife? I gotta get I gotta get storage figured out for us too. Should be enough. Yep. <coughs> Excuse me. Okay. So, pull those out. Still haven't figured this stuff out yet. Transporting into a storage unit. That'll take some time to figure out. Hey, Paladin. What storage? Yeah. So, I'm actually going to go trade at the one librarian I have. Um, I can't do bookshelves. And he gave me mending, so he's kind of the one guy I got to keep for sure. I need more emeralds, of course. Hmm. 
Mm, free glass, okay. Are you gonna give me another book or are you just gonna be my mending guy? Literally gives me a book, okay. Oh, that's right, I got, I got that on. Mana boost, yeah, that's not so great. Let me get rid of crops though. Need emeralds. So melons, I think, are going to be our go-to for a little bit until I can figure out passion fruit, because I have no idea how to get passion fruit. Or these other tomatoes. The farmer's delight tomato. Let's go see if we have any. Don't think I do. Found out how you did what? I do have them. Oh, cool. Okay, well we can do that in one of the cloches really quickly. That'll be another... Another food source. Oh, passion fruit. You found out passion fruit? Did you find it out somewhere or something? Oops, wrong one. What biome was it in? Rainforest. Ooh. Okay, do I have... We could probably go do that really quickly. I don't think I made one. Major Nature's Compass. So it's a compass, four logs, and four saplings. That's something I can go do. Let's see here. Wow. Oh, did I do that wrong? Probably. Has to be logs. Yeah. Okay. Three thousand blocks away. Okay, well we can go and do that because passion fruit will be super handy. Which way do we gotta go? We gotta go this way. I don't mind traveling three thousand blocks to get some passion fruit. Now, too, I can do that. Before I leave, we'll switch this out for onion. Okay. Well, let's go and get it then. have what I'm looking for? Why would I have what I'm looking for? I got 
upgrade that too. Three thousand blocks for these should not be too bad for us. We can travel three thousand blocks, no problem. I have a backpack. What are you talking about? I got backpack. Did you not see me open it? There, I opened my backpack. I always have my backpack. I don't have it enchanted yet because I don't got the, the books for it yet, but that, that's work in progress. Caves. Okay. And we can just easily get back home too. Won't be too hard. Oh yeah, them things are nasty. They're a lot bigger than what they look like too. Another temple. The amount of temples I have on this world are just crazy. So I've considered doing an under, uh, underwater base because of all the water around us. Rainforest, then we'll get some passion fruit, we'll grow it in one of the cloches, and hopefully get a bunch of it to trade with. There's another ocean monument, my gosh! Like every few hundred blocks, I swear. I'm not quite prepared to take one on yet. Still 1,700 blocks away, okay. Couldn't find out how to grow them yet. Oh, okay. So I would assume the seed on a specific type of soil, maybe? Would be my guess. Either that or in the botany pot again? Eh, hmm, I don't know. I'll figure it out once I see it, I guess. We'll try to figure it out. Town of the Fort. Enter and open. Okay, then. That's a little odd, but sure. Why not? Doesn't really seem like a village. Hmm. 
maybe it is. It's just a very high up village. Well then. Uh, I guess we'll take the emeralds. That's a little creepy, but okay. Okay, moving on. Don't know where, nope, don't want that. I just, ah, try and drop the apple. Okay, we will get there eventually. Just another village? It is another village. Well then. Anything of use for us? Probably not. So, so what's this? Oh, it's just another building, okay. Made out of terracotta, nonetheless. Makes sense. That was some kind of berry bush. Webs. Hmm, interesting. Anyway, moving along swiftly. Piggies, raccoons. cows, which you actually probably should, uh, slaughter. Just another 500 blocks, no problem. Dang, Ruth. There's all our cake. Wonder... Eh. Still need fruit. Okay. So, just trying to follow the compass. We'll get these, we'll get back. Work on the villagers some more. Oh my gosh, the lag is just bad as it's trying to reload chunks. Gonna go 
this way more now. Hello, creeper. Pumpkin forest. Okay, now it's a rainforest. Okay, so... Passion fruit? No? Get rid of the knight. There's a grizzly there. With a cub, so we're gonna avoid that. tree. I wonder what it looks like. I guess I don't know. Passion vine. Is that what it is? Vines are on the tree. Okay. So I'm assuming it's going to look like that then. for B. Okay, so that is what it looks like. Okay. It's not fully grown, so I can't harvest it. I don't have enough food. Oh, well, fudge. It's fine. Where was it? It was somewhere over here. Yeah, something like that. I don't have silk touch. Oh, yeah, I do. I don't know if that'll work, though. It does. Okay, so... It's gonna have to be put on a tree, though. Be nice to get more of them. Oh, freaking monkeys. Thanks, but no thanks. There's a village right here. That's kind of interesting. Cattails. And that pig's almost dead. Or half health. Oh, bear. Ooh, is that a uh, blacksmith? Is there any goodies in here for us? Not really. I mean, I'll take the bread, I guess. It's food. I'll put that away. And we can... See if we can't find some more of them. It'd be really handy to get a bunch of them. I'm trying to automate them if they have to grow on a log, that's gonna be the issue, I think. Ooh, corn, okay. Hmm. I haven't eaten a beer yet? Oh, well, that's odd. Thought I did. Um, um, hi? What? Excuse you? Let's see if we can't find some more. Ooh, it's a hummingbird. Bones? Does that turn it into actual bones? Interesting. Trying to find some more. Oh, whole vine like that. Okay, so. Does it have to be grown on the logs, though?
It might. We might have to actually literally have them grow on trees because I don't know how to automate that then. Oh, my inventory is just jam-packed, ain't it? Of course it is. Can we do something like that? That's a lot of logs as well. I don't think my tank has any space. Nope. Need to upgrade this as well. So, <laughs> actually, can somewhat fix this. Not much, but. that, the logs, okay, hmm, stack upgrade for the backpack, I mean, yeah, I need upgrades for, like, everything, iron, I don't have that much iron, though, <clears throat> I don't have an iron farm, I don't have nearly as much iron. I want to get my armor at least with mending. But now that I've got passion fruit. So we're going to have to grow it on trees. I don't know how to automate it though. Chicory root. I don't know if we have that. How far away are we from... Okay, so it's directly west. Okay, well we're gonna do... That. Now that we are here... I don't know if we can put it in a cloche then because in order to grow it, it has tomatoes which it hasn't even done anything yet. Oh, I know why. Can't be the actual, oh, I'll have to fix that in a minute. So my guess is we go something like that. and let the vines grow down and then that's how we harvest it, I would assume. Can I bone meal it? Mm, it's a possibility. Where's my bone meal? Hand bone meal it. Ooh. Okay. Hmm. So, not sure how to automate that then. I do have corn. So it's more wood. Hmm. 
Okay, well, got a little carried away. But passion fruit, it's nice to know that we can now basically get it, but I don't know how to automate that. How do you automate a vine crop? Because the vines have to be on a log. I wonder... Let's just try temporarily. Get rid of that, and then... Where'd I put it? Do one of those... With the vine? Would that actually work? In the quash? I don't know. This one? Yes. So if we put a log... I don't know if that actually is going to work. It might. Don't know. Let's see if I can't get at least mending on my pick. Oh, I have mending. I need mending on everything else, so I need XP now. Hmm. I don't have any other spawners, I don't believe. that's actually working. Why is water running so low? Oh. I wonder if I need to put another pump in. Or a, like a sink or something. Ooh, yeah, that water's almost gone. right there. Would that help? Hmm. I would assume it would help, but again, I don't know for certain. think this is working. There's a thought. But it seems to go pretty quick. So getting a spawner for XP I think would be the next thing. Or just trying to get the villagers into a location. Oh, and mine's all over the place right now. So I need books. I need slabs. There's a book, a slab. some vector plates. We're going to need quite a few slabs, actually. And I got... We're going to still trade... What do we need most? Hmm. I'm going to put one more vine on. Okay, 
probably gonna need Grab those. Regardless, I need emeralds, so we're gonna have to grab a couple stacks of melons, a few carrots, and some potatoes. Let's see what we can trade. Potatoes. Your tomatoes, which I don't have yet. Hear that. And no carrots from you. Melons to you. Carrots for you. Gave me a cookie, okay. You want carrots as well, which I don't have enough of. No melons, okay. They'll take the melons, okay, that'll work. And we will get rid of this. I need to make a few. I mean, I have some slabs, but we'll do that. And now I need to get, yeah, we'll just do a stack for now. Come over to you and buy a handful of bookshelves. We're only gonna break four, because we need the other four for lecterns. What in the world? Thank you. Okay, so now we have to attempt to get this right. Um, over this way. There we go. That'll give space. Here we need to go in. A couple. Take a free book. Something like that, and one more, I think. We don't have anywhere to put the appetite right now. It's going in the backpack along with that. this on us so we can attempt to try to get four more librarians. I don't know if the path find this far though. Hmm. 
Maybe they will. No, so I'm gonna have to make another workstation. Oh, it's gonna be easiest. Probably, probably a composter. Would be easiest. Composter. So we'll set it here and see how how much one villager will want to try to get to it. And we'll just keep using this trick, moving it around till he takes another workstation. Is he actually going to take a workstation? He is. Look at that. Now if you could get in there please so I can keep you in there. Or not. Wherever you want to go I guess. I mean... I don't care which luck turn you take. Just get in there so I can refresh your trades, please. No, please. Come on now. Be nice. Okay, we're just going to pick up all these other lecterns. Including that one. Get in, please, and stay. Thank you. Fire protection for it's actually not too bad. But we need to get some other villagers in these other ones as well. Set that there. Anybody any takers? Ooh, I didn't want the baby! Oh, dang nabbit. Well, it's fine. It's fine. It's fine. Eventually, he'll grow up and he'll take a workstation. It's fine. And you have insight, which ain't the greatest. These villagers, man. What did I do with my dirt? I put my dirt back, didn't I? I did. not want to take it? Where'd he go? I'm way over there. Wow, okay. Well, let's see if we can't fix this really quickly. That should help anyway. Place that there maybe? Maybe he'll take a workstation. Whoa. You lost your profession immediately. Okay. It's fine. Get you in this area really quickly, hopefully. He says hopefully. There you go. You went in without even asking. Nice. Thank you, sir. Please? Where'd they go? Take a free book, sure. Uh, you, of course, would have to come over here somewhere, wouldn't you? So if we remove both of these, yet again, place them so they can't escape. Unbreaking, too, that'd be nice. Gosh, you guys, unbreaking one. Okay, I think we're gonna have to do one guy at a time. Just to make this a little simpler. Which one's gonna take it? And that guy, okay. There we go. Projectile protection. Not the greatest, but... Oh, I love that. You just walk right into the location. Perfect. End veil. It's actually not a bad enchantment. 
not quite what we're looking for, but it could do in a pinch. And now this guy, he's actually grown up, which is really handy, actually. And psych him out. Lure him a little bit more, maybe. Or if he's going to keep walking away, I guess. I mean, sure. Now you can't go back, sir. Oh, he wasn't even going to focus on that one. Awesome. And in you go, please. Please? What do you got? Obliteration 4. Hmm. Well, that'd be nice if I had an iron farm, but unfortunately I do not have an iron farm. Not as of yet. There we go. Okay, so now the real question is... Do I go up and try to trade, or do I go get a bunch of paper? I think we go get a bunch of paper really quickly. So we're going to need it. We should have plenty over this way. Not paper, but sugar cane. Okay, not nearly as much as I wanted, but it works. Could always put that in a cloche as well. And there's a lot of paper. Okay, so now let's... Now, in my opinion, the... Not only can be fun and tedious at the same time. Now... Fudge your nuggets. So, trying to get in here to get that. And getting rid of those. Oh, I don't even have the inventory space for it. Mmm. Bullets. There. Okay, temporarily. Can you at least get in there so I don't have to keep... There. Okay, so if we go like this... And we're gonna have to, like, do this. Luck of cheap repairing. No, probably not. Or probably not. So this is the, the tedious process. Come on, man. Pick a corner. Or pick a block. Not both, please. Thank you. And we're gonna do this so you can't keep doing that. Ooh, fortune three. That actually might not be bad. You know what? We'll do it. Why not? Fortune 3 is actually a pretty good enchantment. Instigating? Yeah, we could do that too. But you're set up okay for right now. What do you got? Envale? Do I want Envale? I don't know. I think there's other enchantments I'd rather want right now. Oh man, come on dude, pick a side please. Thank you. We'll do that, and we will put the torch behind your head maybe. That should work. This way you can't go back and forth. Curse of Vanishing, no, please, uh-uh, sorry. Infinity. Now that actually I think would be a good trade. Because Infinity can be used on the bow. And can be used on the water buckets, which is really handy actually. I apparently need more paper. We might have to put one of those in a cloche just to be safe. Probably wouldn't hurt. Um, this one, maybe? Why is there melons in it? 
It's because I took the melons out. And this isn't producing anything. Because you need the seeds. There. Okay. So we need to do... Just do this really quickly, otherwise I will forget. Because I'm good at forgetting. I really am. Piece of sand, and we will do a piece of sugar cane. Hopefully it'll be better. We'll do it in which one? This one, I believe. Yep. There we go. That should work. Okay. We'll do three more. some more paper. There we go. Okay. So we are going to have to figure out, I think, I'm going to have to keep this here for right now. Gear Infinity, so I can switch gear to this. Get that back. And that should hopefully help repair the pickaxe a little bit. Now you want lan- I don't really care for lanterns myself, but... Some people like them, some people don't. I, I personally don't care for them. Okay, well you threw us another book, I will take it. I'm gonna go get rid of the lanterns, because I don't- We're just gonna throw them in the chest. For now. Let's see what we can get from the other guy here. Projectile protection. Mm. I mean, maybe, but I don't know if that's what I want right now. I think unbreaking or efficiency would be a heck of a lot better. Especially for the tools and armor. Grab the right inventory slot. Furrowing. Uh uh, sorry. Oh my gosh. I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to have to uh, move this around for just a moment. Endless Quiver, so that's essentially Infinity. I don't know if Infinity or Endless Quiver would be better. Makes all arrows infinite. Yes and no. Bork. Hmm. Cheap repairing, no thank you. Quick charge, don't have a crossbow, so it's useless. End veil again. Hmm. Maybe we should do it. I don't know. We'll do that and see what happens. Need more emeralds, of course. So can I trade away a bunch of paper to you guys? I can. At least to you. Instigating, Fortune 3. This is our mending guy. But I want... Emeralds, please. I can actually break down the bookshelves for more books. And we can trade them back away to him. Mana boost. Yeah, no, sorry. Not a very good one. Oh, we didn't trade with this guy yet. Oh, I thought we did. My bad. Let's go get some more uh, paper again. Okay, 
Okay, so this should help us. I don't know what trade we want to get with this guy now. Like I said, efficiency or unbreaking would be ideal. Uh, we're going to switch this with this. And we're going to... Where is he? Oh, other side. Here we go. So, I'm going to like so. I'm going to break this one. Uh, we should put that torch back, actually. I'm going to do it like that. There we go. And let's see what we can roll with this. Oh, snap. Well. I guess we'll like that. Looting two. Hmm. Would that be worth it? Hmm. No, we really do need unbreaking and efficiency more than we need those. Okay, I'm gonna put this away for now. So we can focus on this. Respiration three? Hmm. Hmm. I think after we get some of these trades, we might just go caving. See if we can't find some good stuff in some caves or something. If I could find a good spawner that we could turn into an XP farm, it'd be great. Outlaw. Four? Mmm. I don't really want to get that, because that's... Mm, that'd be increasing damage to villagers, so... I don't really need that. Bullseye 2 for guns. Luck of cheap repairing, no. Send of bolts. Ooh. If we could get the Knowledge of the Ages enchantment, I'd be all for that. Splitting five. Hmm. Perhaps, but right now I really want unbreaking or efficiency. Sea Infusion three. Hmm. Teleportation, no thank you. Retarming board. Turns instant to the rider's inventory when broke. Hmm. Okay. Soulbound. Um. Soulbound would be good. But being as this is our last villager that I have available right now, I mean, we can always make space for more, of course, but... For 11? Eh, maybe we'll wait. I'm sure one of these other villagers, once we trade with them, they'll probably give us that as well. Seems to be a pretty common enchantment, which is nice. So there's really a enchantment we're looking for, which is kind of what I am looking for right now, unbreaking in any form. Smite 5. Now that's a good one, actually. For 16? Hmm. Maybe. Impaling, no thanks. Bulwark again. Instigating again. Villagers. Infinity? I thought we had infinity. Yeah, I'm pretty sure we have infinity now.
Okay. We're trying to get something decent here. I mean, like I said, efficiency or unbreaking is really what I'm after right now. Obliteration, anvil enchantment, capturing two. Mm. I mean, that'd be good, but it's not great. Oops, didn't want to do that. Knockback 2, probably not useful right now. And Disruption 5. It's actually really good, but I don't think we're ready to go to the end just yet. I mean, we have a Blaze Spawner and I don't have a decent source of Ender Pearls yet. best way to get those is probably in the uh, the nether by trading with piglins I'm guessing is probably gonna be the best way to get ender pearls at least until we go to the end and then we can make an enderman farm like I said I think once we get done with this guy we're gonna go caving for a little while because it'd be really nice to get to figure out some stuff Get a couple spawners, it'd be really nice. Just exploring in general. <coughs> Excuse me. Yeah, that I don't really care for. There's some binding. There we go, efficiency three. It's not the greatest, but you know, we'll take it. It's better than not having any at all. And you do, so you do the book trade. So I need paper trade? For emeralds? <laughs> oh, that's funny, Siren. Uh, yeah, yeah, you ain't wrong. You're not wrong, that's for sure. What'd I unlock? What did we unlock? <laughs> hey, I'm not gonna say nothing. I can't think of crap like that. If I do, it'll take me forever, and then I'll think of it like right before bed or something. It's, yeah. The creeper face one, so it's creepo. Mm, that's not a very good one. At least not in my opinion. So. And now. We can trade books. Break those. You're the book guy? Yes, you're the book guy. For emeralds. We'll get more, I guess. Don't know if that's gonna be enough. Oh dang, you're done trading. Okay. You do books, okay. So I really need I mean efficiency is great. Did I trade him? I did trade with him because I wanted Envale. Efficiency three. Probably put that on our pickaxe. And we'll need mending and unbreaking on the hammer for sure, along with efficiency. I want unbreaking though. So this is only five. And this is our mending dude for eight. Well, no, I'm just trying to get a few enchanted books that I really want to get my tools and armor a little better because I have no enchantments on my armor. And my tools, the only tool is my pick that has some enchantments, so... I know. Got three of them. You got three of them right there. I suppose, yeah, just trading some sticks right now would probably be good. 
<laughs> I just have to turn around. I know right where they're at. This is kind of my emerald making station. <laughs> Between Fletchers and Farmers. Yeah. What time of day is it? Yeah, we could probably go up and get some more and make some more. I have plenty of wood, I just it's, I keep forgetting about it. My inventory is such a mess. You need help with many things. What what do you what do you talk about that? You're draining the ocean. Wow. Are you using sand or sponges or a combination of the two? Cause that'd be the way to do it. Sand or gravel to block it off in sections and then drain it. With sponges typically. Sand, yeah, that's it's yeah, you section it off and then use sponges to drain it, and it's tedious, but it, it's I mean I don't know of any other way. I'm sure somebody else probably does, but I don't. It's the only way I know of how to clear out a monument. Or if you weren't trying to make it a guardian farm, just use soul sand. Holy smokes. Our tools builder. I have no idea what that is either. Building. It's a block that places blocks? I didn't know that. I don't know all that many mods. I mean, I'm still fairly new to a lot of it. And yeah, I just typed it in J. Yeah, I didn't see it. Is it a builder? It is a builder, so it'd be that, right? It's brick, pearl, redstone, machine frame, that's actually pretty cheap. Didn't that work? Bricks are easy. Emeralds, redstone, so. Wow, okay, that'd be kind of cool. And the shape, the shape card cube, I think. Oh, okay. But it can eat power. Oh, yeah, that's... Shape card for placing liquids or the pump? Clearing pump? Just be a shield of the builder. I'm assuming that's what it would be then? The regular one? Shape card? Huh. Okay, yeah, that I'm not even... Oh, because of the water sources. Oh, I suppose that makes sense. Interesting. Doesn't seem like it's too difficult to make. It's a regular shape card to place the blocks. Okay. You can really easily remove the sand. Oh, okay. There you go, Paladin. Somebody helped you out. They'll use up 2k RF per tick. Ooh, wow. Yeah, that's... I mean, we are producing quite a bit on that world, so... 
What was I doing now? I forget. I got sidetracked. Like it'll run on less. Oh, okay. It'll run slower, well, of course. Yeah, if it doesn't have full power. Okay. Um. Okay, let me like empty my inventory a little bit. At least a little bit of it. Don't need that. So we'll set it aside for now. So I need to go figure out an XP farm for XP so that we can repair things. Let's trade with the villagers really quickly, get some XP maybe. I don't even need cabbage, so I can actually probably pull this. Thought I was gonna need it, but I don't. Carrots. Don't have any potatoes. Let's go see how much of this we can get rid of. Take melons, thankfully. And your potatoes that I don't have, and tomatoes. So getting the aloe would be kind of nice, but. Apparently I've eaten it, but I don't know where I've eaten it. Okay. Have I eaten that? I have not eaten carrots yet. Ooh. Okay. Can I trade away the rest of this passion fruit? Probably. What's our pick? Not quite half yet. There's that. Carrots. Okay. Rest of the melons. Okay, I think we're gonna go explore now and see if I can't find a spawner that I can actually utilize for a mob farm. It's not quite half, but it'll do, I think. We're gonna need to make Some torches, though. My inventory is such a mess. Do I have... I need a better way to produce coal and charcoal, I think. to upgrade it yet. Not enough. Don't need the slab. too much that I need fruit which I don't really have unless I have some gapples which I don't know if I have too many it's another thing I gotta figure out is food steady supply of variety of foods
sometimes get cold too, so I shouldn't be too worried. Okay, so I don't know. I think we'll head. I think we'll head this way, northeast. Go down and do some do some mining. See what we can explore. See what we can find. Do you play a lot of modded siren? Not actively, but you played it. So you so you have good knowledge of modded then, in other words. You don't play probably as often as you'd like, maybe, I'm assuming. Or you're just not into it lately, which, hey, I get it. Everybody has their taste. You gotta take a break, you know? Don't don't burn yourself out. It's kind of how I look at it. If you just don't feel like doing it, don't force it, you know? I went from regular Minecraft to Buddy and Me playing and... This particular pack, or just uh, a modded pack in general? Hey, if you play every couple days, you're still active on it. I mean... Hey, that's fine. If it got stale for you, then... Then you're just hurting yourself trying to play it, that's all. It's not good for you. Don't do it if you don't enjoy it. That's kind of how I look at it. Oh my gosh, flag. Oh, wow. This pack has been very fun, yes. It, the variety and the amount of mods that are in this pack, I, I couldn't even, I could tell you right now, I haven't dabbled in hardly any of them. The only thing I wish it had were a couple mods that I want to try out, but... I want to try out Easy Villagers, and I want to kind of explore Tinkers a little bit more, which aren't in these mod packs, this particular mod pack, so... Cake. I want cake. Cake's good. I don't know how to add them! I'm not good at that. I don't know how to do that. I'm a noob at trying to mess with stuff like that. You like Tetra more than Tinkers? Oh, I mean, okay, hey! Everybody has their taste. Unbreaking one. What? Close quarters. I've already opened a bunch of loot chests. I suppose with the new update. Do I take it? Eh, probably not. I mean, that's all good stuff, but... Mmm... Eh. I could combine them. There's an anvil here. There was an anvil here. Oh, hey, yeah, if you play the same one for so long, yeah, I could understand, yeah. I could completely get that. There, now I got Unbreaking One Bow. It's not great, but it'll work. All that matters is if you enjoy it. That's, In my opinion, that's all that really matters. If you don't like it, then don't do it, you know? Efficiency 2 Iron Pick. Obliteration 5. I will take that. Don't really want the string. But Obliteration 5, that's kind of nice. What's easy? What? Did I miss something? forget which mod Tetra is. Oh, it's this mod. I, I haven't even freaking done anything with this. I don't understand it. Oh, yeah, exactly. If you're not enjoying it, then don't don't hurt yourself trying to force yourself to do it. It really isn't. Uh, yeah, see, I don't know how to, like, break open the geos. I don't know how to do any of that. Found some of these, like, structures in the underground and don't even know how to like break these blocks because they require a certain hammer or something. I don't get that. 
I'm a noob. <laughs> I can admit it. I should have a book. I, I do, but it just doesn't make sense. Is it? Which tome? This tome? That tome? That Kaisic tome or whatever? Tetra and Holosphere, I suppose that's probably what the one it is. Yeah, it's just not something I was kind of too keen on uh, going through. There's monsters nearby, what? I mean, personally, I really like the Trinkets. I really love the Trinkets mod, I really do. I've had Trinkets of a few others. But that requires reading, and I don't want to read. <laughs> No, I just gotta spend the time and actually do it. That's... Really? <laughs> what, do you think it's sad? <laughs> Last thing I wanna do is read something. I mean, I'd rather just experience it, but I get it. It's just like any other thing. A manual is very nice to have. I don't even... What the heck was I doing? Oh, that's right. We were gonna go mining. Oh, I'm sure I could, I, if I actually took the time to learn about each and every kind of mod I want to know about, I'm sure there's plenty of things out there I could do. Oh, well, hello little baby. I'll let you come out and burn in the sun, yeah. How are you not burning? Like, seriously. I suppose that we could kind of dig down by this house. Probably a good spot to dig down. Just a bunch of wheat? Yeah. <laughs> well, hey, nobody likes the baby zombies in Minecraft. I mean, wow, well, I shouldn't say nobody. There's probably people that do, but myself, no, I don't care for them whatsoever, personally. Yeah, I mean, if you're really that knowledgeable, I mean, I'd be love I'd love to like pick your brain, so to speak. And see, I hate this kind of block personally. The scoria, mm, I don't like it at all. Too dark of a block in my opinion. Yeah, I know how to use Ultimine. Yeah. I could, but I, I don't know. There are a bunch of spiders. Aha. Uh -huh. I thought it was near a cave. It's kind of what I wanted. Yeah, I've done it a couple times. Why is there stone brick right there? Typically that means a structure, right? Is that a stronghold? That can't be a stronghold, can it? Oh, zombie spawner. That'll be perfect, actually. Yeah, I've utilized it a lot too, but at the same time, it's, uh, it, it plunges my hunger, and I don't always have the best food. I mean, right now I do, but it's a zombie brute, ain't it? Uh, I want to check, do I have, I don't have the balloon on. I could do that too, that'd be kind of cool. 
Got a ring. Amulets. Take the books, I suppose. Wooden altar. Yep, the zombie brute didn't stand a chance. What is that? Increased length of invisibility when... I don't use invisibility. See, I don't know what the runes are for. Steel ingots are handy. I don't know what cardboard's for. Why do I keep hearing the dang zombies all over the place? Whoops. Throw them on with an anvil. Rune changes the enchantment glow color on your tools. Really? That's interesting to know. I didn't know that. So you could turn something green with the anvil? Whatever the color is? That's kind of cool, actually. It's nice to know. Zombie spawner, make sure I got silk touch. Yay, silk touch. It's nice to know, thanks for that. Oh, so instead of, okay, that's actually kind of cool. So you could change the color, literally. I like that. Especially if I could find a color I really like, that'd be kind of cool. Thank you for that, it's nice to know. Cardboard box for those spawners if you don't have silk touch. Wait, what? Really? Oops. Is there a cardboard box? I can type right? Oh, I didn't know you can make a cardboard box. Out of paper? Really? I didn't know that. That's interesting to note. Just pulverize a log or two. Yeah, that'd probably work too. That's good to know, I mean, if I didn't know that. Because I always just thought you had to use soft touch. Now, are there any ores I really need to be like on the lookout for, you think? Like, specifically? You want the mechanism one? I thought I had it. Can you pick up any single block without messing it up? Hmm. It's good to know. Nothing you can think of? Okay, nothing special? Cool. I thought like nickel or something, or there was like a... I don't remember. There was an ore that was really hard to come by. Spawners, chests, machines, whatever. Hey, that's handy. Just pick it up and move them? Hey, that'd be good to do. Excuse you. Alum nickel and aluminum? See, I don't know what aluminum is for. I've, I've gotten nickel before, but... Digital miner? It's... Oh. I suppose, yeah, it's automating it, yeah. Aluminum is for immersive engineering. Oh, okay. Well, hi, spider. How did I not hit it? It's a spawner again. What do you know? It's probably a spider spawner. Now that, I don't know if it's worth keeping. I mean, it'd be string. Ooh, a spawner agitator. I've used them before. Steel horse armor. Interesting. Hmm, 
Is it worth the spider spawner? It probably is. As long as it's not a frickin' uh, cave spider, I think I'll be fine. Can't stand cave spiders. I didn't know you can change what it spawns. What? See, that's news to me. Okay, well you probably know a heck of a lot more with a spawn egg of a mob. Oh, interesting. Do I have, I have slime spawns, <laughs> slime spawn eggs. <laughs> oh crap, wrong button. I mean, either way, it's still interesting to know. Fluorite, I have no idea. See, I didn't even know that was possible. I don't even know where did we come down from. This way. So somewhere in here. I think. I don't remember. Yeah, and see, ours nouveau. I it just doesn't look like that'd be something I'd want just doesn't seem like it'd be something I'd be interested in. I know a lot of people might be, but personally, it doesn't seem like it'd be for me. Well, I guess I can just do this. Okay, I mean... It probably is, I'm not saying it's not, but... Mm, don't have a whole lot of durability left. Hmm. I mean, yeah, that's just it. It could be... I mean, it could be super useful and it could look cool at the same time. I no clue. I really don't want to break the hammer, but I mean it's obsidian, so I guess I can always replace it. So how far did you get in this pack? I'm just out of curiosity. Well, I mean, that can mean different things to different people. I mean, you say you're not that far, but you could be further than you think, I guess. I don't know. Digital miner. I don't even have a digital miner. Because I didn't even know it was a thing. You haven't done a lot of stuff, but you have a lot of stuff. Well, I mean, something to be said about that.
So you can just do the stuff. Yeah, hey, I get it. Completely get it. For me, I just like to kind of... I like to explore, but I mean, learning about new mods is kind of nice. What the heck? The creeper has a backpack on? Okay, then. But yeah, I can, I, I mean, to your point, I could understand you're getting bored because you know a lot of it. The backpack plays music. Oh, interesting. Fine, I'll give you a piece. Oh, I thought I did. Do I not? Probably don't because of... Yeah, dude, it's just pretty low. Yeah. I could understand it being like an ambiance kind of feature or something. I mean, you could be right. You probably know better than I do. See, before they updated this, you used to get Angel Wing, which was really nice once you got to the end. But they've removed that now, as far as I know. Yeah, because now you can't get the Angel Ring. Now you have to get... I don't remember what it's called. It's a trinket, I think. Yeah, these, the magical feathers. This is what you have to get if you want creative flight. Not obtainable randomly, so you have to craft it. Which, I mean, is not terribly difficult, but... I've done it before, it's actually not difficult. I mean, Eyes of Ender, those are easy. Infused diamonds, which dimensional shards are easy. Prismarine shards are pretty easy to get, just from killing, what you call them, uh, guardians. The potion of flight, that you can get from shulkers, killing shulkers. And then the magical feather is a little more complex. I don't remember which one did I do, I think I did this one with the protective fabric. Cured rubber. The cap, which was hard because it's bare hair. This Daku Lee was a paraglider in leaves, which isn't hard. The boots. And the lightning charge, because you need the blitz powder. Not a hard... Yeah, exactly. Just involved. Yes, very much so. Atomic alloy. Yeah, that was difficult. I did that, I don't know, one or two times ago when I played it. So yeah, eventually it'd be nice to get that. But, I've noticed that if, uh... When we get to the end, the better end mod, it's actually really nice. It looks really pretty anyway. I do like the sleeping bag. Such a nice feature. Okay, where are we at? That's the dead sea. See the amount of freaking monuments that are on this map. One there, one there, there. Oh, that's right, I updated so you can't see. I started like way down here or something. I mean like way down here. Came up here and there was probably a dozen different ocean monuments. That's where we got the villagers from. I don't know if I got lucky. I mean, I don't know how lucky that is, because I don't know how useful it is. I'd love to get the Neptunium 
I'm gonna have tunium armor and stuff. But that takes a lot of fishing time. I have a couple pieces, but not many. No ocean in your world yet? You can't find one? Have you ever made... Here, let's go home. And... Have you ever made... Where did I put it? Nature's compass. I was just gonna say, have you made the nature's compass? I just crafted that, cause, but early in stream we went and found passion fruit. Which is right there, because we needed that to trade. So yeah, I've done that. Haven't been looking. I mean, hey, if you don't need it, then there's no really a real point to look for it. I get it. Now, if I do that with the iron and that with the aluminum, casual exploration. Yeah, I get that. Put that there. I'm really curious. You said. If we put that in the room, make it look green. <laughs> but that costs 15 levels. Mm. Don't quite have that many levels yet. I mean, I have them, but. Yeah, see, I got an axe, a Neptunium axe. Got a few things over on the fishing platform that I have over there. But yeah, like this stuff, like. All this mechanism machines, I don't have a whole lot of idea what's going on. And I thought with the transporters I could put them into a chest, and then I thought we could feed something into them, but I can't remember what those pipes are. Because it'd be nice to just throw stuff in there, double the ores, and then like getting advanced smeltery to smelt the stuff would be nice, but... I don't know. I'm crazy too, I suppose. Metal dirt. Why do I have so much metal dirt? There's the blaze spawner. I need to freaking work on refined storage. I think that's my next thing, is refined storage. I don't know. I, I have no idea. I tried the basics. The basics didn't work. Just to pull the items out and put them in a storage unit. Storage thing. I can't remember the type of the pipe. I don't think I saved it. I don't remember. No, they're not pulling it out. I thought they were supposed to automatically pull it out. I'm probably using the wrong kind of pipe, but I crafted those because I thought those were what worked, but unless they need power, but I, I don't know. Not something I'm good at. A configurator that the quest gave you? I don't know. You need to set them to pull. The wrench? I don't think I got it from a quest. I don't know from the quest book. The mechanism's wrench is called a configurator. Oh! See, I didn't know that. So, configurator card. Yeah, I, can, I got that. Maybe I put it somewhere? This wrench? Oh, okay. Yeah, I crafted this wrench, actually. I didn't get given it. I had to craft it. So, I need to... Link, rotate, config... Soon config. Hmm, doesn't seem to. 
have it in my backpack. Mm. Yeah, that one's not working, so I don't know. What's to create? Refined. First mechanism re quest reward. Mechanism. That one probably. There we go. Yeah, I haven't clearly done. <laughs> So, what? I just changed the color. Yeah, yeah and shift, right click, that's what I'm doing. Pull. Care about the color really. Why is it changing the color? Not in the middle part? Oh. What? In the connection part? There. That the ones coming from the machine to pull. Okay. Pull. Dang fly go away. Let's set them in the output at bottom. Oh. So, in the interface, yeah, that's what I'm looking at. Side config. Okay, eject off. Output bottom. Is that right? Project. Oh. It's in the top right. Yeah, auto eject, right? Okay, so I got it, but it's not. Hmm. I can't tell. Don't know what the color has to do. Do they have to be the same color? Colors are for channels. Oh. So I just want to make them none then. Okay. Strict input. Oh, I suppose. Yeah, I guess that makes sense. Okay. 
so that should all be right. Yeah, so there's no color. I don't want it to be a color. Okay. Well, I mean, I think I have it set up right. Eject on. I'll put it at the bottom. That looks right. Auto eject on. Oh, the chest needs to be set. How do I set the chest? Set to pull. Oh, dang colors. Yeah, I'm not very good, clearly. <laughs> oh, I don't want the colors. I look at the face of the pipe next to the chest. Okay. Normal. Push. Pull. So it needs to be push, right? didn't work yeah oh now it did oh look at that what do you know <laughs> uh, see it helps having somebody walk me through <laughs> somebody who actually knows what they're doing unlike me it did work yes uh, so then we just have to once it's all doubled then we have to put it into like a some kind of advanced smeltery I suppose but then we would be able to Put some pipes into here from like a chest or something to be smelted or to be enriched. Any kind of furnace. Yeah, that's why I was thinking the advanced. I mean, regardless, it wouldn't matter, but. I mean, a blast. Oh, excuse me. A blast furnace would probably be ideal. Okay, so we have quite a bit of charcoal there, not a huge amount, but... Okay, do you know what I can do with all this excess coal coke I'll be getting? should actually probably put this away for right now. blast furnace yeah the only reason the only reason I used the coke oven was because I needed to crease with oil to make treated planks so I'd put the bucket in and uh, wrap the bucket of creosote with planks to get creosote or to get treated wood to make the cloche the garden cloches that's the only reason I really had that Oh, it's like regular coal, but twice as good. So it burns twice as slow or something? Hmm, okay. Interesting to note. Oh, okay. Like I said, pigmen, what? I just want to figure out like a better fuel source that's kind of somewhat renewable. 
And with the, the dang botany pots now taking 20 minutes to grow. Yeah, I'll, I'll have to figure that out, I'm sure. Okay, you're just gonna be way too noisy, sir. I really need to fix that, apparently. Best way to one is with all the metal dirt. <laughs> Nothing wrong yet, but then his his noises will make it not fun. <laughs> I mean, I can be cruel, but I can be nice sometimes. Not always. to do this right? Probably not. Of course not. need it for the undergarden, but do you know if there's like another dimension? I thought I remember seeing something about like another kind of dimension you can go to, but I don't even know how to go to it. Not that it really matters, but I just out of curiosity. <clears throat> so let's go get a mining dimension. Okay. So can I get mending put on the obsidian hammer? It'd be really nice. Oh, interesting. <laughs> well, it makes sense. I mean, I'm gonna put this away. Do I have? Whoops! Just wanted to go here. Take that out, and we're gonna go with that in there. Take that out. Really wanna upgrade this too. But I need emerald blocks, I believe. Yeah, eight emerald blocks. And diamond, then obsidian. Obsidian easy, but. I wanted to get mending on the hammer. It's from occultism. Oh, okay. Not a mod I'm really too fond of trying to go into personally. It's not really the same thing. Wait, what? Never seen the mod. Yeah, it wouldn't surprise me. I mean, occultism is here. So. Yeah, not something I probably want to go into. Stable wormhole. Yeah, I don't think I'd like that, personally. <laughs> and then... Yeah, I don't want to do blood magic, either. There's Ars Nouveau. Magic is a lot of fun. 
See, Blood Magic, Eldeon, and Occultism are probably ones I wouldn't go into. Really? Interesting. Okay, well, hey, I mean, if you like it, that's, you know, that's all that really matters. See, I think one that I might want to go into is Astral Sorcery. I think that'd be kind of interesting. Yeah, Create's really nice. Not too, I'm not too thrilled about magic mods. Not something I personally really want to get into. Okay, um... Jeez, that'd be... Holy crap. Yeah, that'd be interesting, that's for sure. Okay, well, let's see here. I need, like... Gosh, I need inventory space so bad. So it'd be nice to I think what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go downstairs somewhere and set up a space to um Well, I think we're gonna go over this way. Do I have the thing set up still? Am I just being an idiot? Of course I am, because I still have one set up over here. I completely forgot all about it. I had it set up, and I completely forgot all about it. Like, no joke. I was kind of wondering why. I just, I think I'm going to have to adjust this by putting the spawner up, like... 10 blocks, maybe? Because I think if I did this... Yeah, I even put a sad an agitator on it. Yeah. <laughs> uh-huh. Uh-huh. Really? Really? I completely forgot all about those. That's very interesting, actually. See, you're so knowledgeable about this stuff. A diamond sword, which... Okay, whatever. Phantom membranes, which we have. Cyan die, though. That's... Not something I think I have. Isn't that just, like, blue and green dye? Yeah, I was like, it's... It, yeah, that's what I figured. So... We have to get from cacti. Then we need to make a diamond sword, which is really easy to do.
You've been super, super helpful, helpful. Siren. <laughs> Telling me things I don't even know about it. I hope it's been somewhat entertaining for you. Watch, I bet I actually had some. Maybe not. Okay, do what you gotta do. And then, oh, Phantom Membrane Witch. I swear I had a bunch of them. Do I not have any of them? Thought I had phantom membranes. Do I not? I swear I thought I did. Really, I do not. Ooh. pickaxe from. Probably from a zombie. Most likely. I swear I thought I had some phantom membranes. Hmm, I don't, so that's the only thing stopping me now. For making it, right? Oh, and then the blank plates, which are fairly easy. Really odd. I don't have phantom membranes. I guess that means I can't sleep much longer. I don't get to sleep. Dang. I wonder if I have some over there. Let's go take a quick look. Don't think I do, but who knows? Might. Oh yeah, if I need... Sorry, Paladin, I didn't see your message till just now. Yeah, I'd be more than happy to invite him to our world. Home, sword, and boots. Now you're littering? Of course, I'd say that. Okay, I don't... Yeah, I don't have phantom membranes in order to make those killing plates. Well, I guess we're gonna have to fix that then. Because I don't think there's any other way to get it. some, but I don't. Nautilus shells. Hmm. 
So the best way to get them, I guess, is just to wait till nighttime. I'm gonna have to wait at least two more nights, I think, before they even attempt to spawn. while we wait then is we'll just go down and kill some zombies then because I need to wait for phantoms to spawn Plate would be super handy. And then the blank plates, we just need black dye, which we can get, and stone is easy. So let's go do that really quick before I forget for the umpteenth time. we can just turn those into black ink. I need a bunch of stone. What stone do I want to use? Uh, let's use cobble. So... Oh, it actually has to be solid stone. Oh, no wonder. So, can you slate? Can you slate? That should be way more than enough. <clears throat> I'm so tempted to sleep, but now we can't because we need the phantoms. I had the cabbage. I had no reason for it. That's right. So now they're stuck. Hurt to put another one in there. So we have another one, right? Oh, it's a spider. So there's the other zombie one. I can reach it. Give her a try, shall we? so they can actually see me. Don't know how effective two will be, but... See, this is where Smite would probably be really nice on the sword. Smite, looting, both would be really good probably. 
Even if it was just one, how much would that give? It gives us three. That's really nice, actually, and it's actually fairly simple. lit up a bunch of caves around it, so it should be okay. Don't really see any reason for the mining helmets. There's got to be a better way to increase their spawn rate. I'm sure there is. Oh, I think if I remember right. Did we... Uh, I think if we added sugar to it and increased it, I think. So we'll go and see if this works. It may or may not, if I'm trying to remember correctly here. It's going this way. Creeper? Sounded like a creeper. Pumpkin heads. Why do they have jack o' lanterns on? Not really sure. Uh, let's put this back. I suppose we could actually go trade with the villagers while we wait for more phantoms. Try to get our dank upgraded, maybe. And we'll need crops for that. How are our crops doing over here? Oh, you did not just do that. I did not just see you do that, Mr. Skeleton. I don't know how he got up, but he got up and over somehow. torches here. Oh, we still got some spawnable spaces within the base. Oh. Didn't even know about that. That probably is part of it. I can't put it there. That's right. That. Is that better? I think that's a little better. 
didn't want the tomatoes yet. We got a couple spots up here, it looks like. The rest should be fine. Nope. There. Yeah, I don't want any other mobs to spawn within. What do we need here? We need fruit. Well, I don't got... Although, wait a minute. We can utilize the villager thing. Oh, better turn that off. And take some of this. And what was the mulberry thing? So I need a glass bottle and a piece of sugar. we have, I thought we had some glass bottles. Did we use them already? There's the sugar. I need to, oh my gosh. The inventory mess. Let's put that back. See any glass bottles? Hmm. There's two. There we go. Okay, so can we make two of those and then where did I put? Oh. Can at least do one. There we go. I think we need a few more pieces of sugar to make some more of the uh, what you call it jam. Oh my gosh. There we go, now, like so. Good enough. Should be good for now, I suppose. Now we got this that we can eat. Is a fruit. Let me get rid of some logs here really quickly. There. Made some space. Okay. We need to grab some stuff to trade though. out of water. How is it out of water? How do I fix that? Oh, I gotta figure that out now. We'll do melons. And do you want stuff in Elgar yet? So get rid of all that. 
few more melons. Okay. <sighs> okay, so we really need Ages would be really nice. Lodge of the ages would be super nice. Glass. And sweeping edge ain't bad. But I do want to get a bunch of emeralds to upgrade our dank. Don't know if that's going to be enough. Not quite. That should be enough. Now we should be able to upgrade the dank. There we go. Another row. That's going to be super useful. Uh, diamonds. We're going to need quite a few diamonds to upgrade, though. Do we have, we have one diamond in the backpack? I don't know how many I have here. That's not enough. Nowhere near enough diamonds. Okay, well, I gotta figure out why all of a sudden these are not getting water now. What is going on? How come the pump isn't providing enough water? Get rid of that. Is that gonna provide any water? Okay, it provides water to some. Not everything. Do I need to make another fluid pump? Just for this section, probably? I'm thinking that's probably going to have to be the case. Because it's not providing enough water. I don't understand why. Output, okay. That's why they're not receiving water now. Get it. Put the sink here. Closhes aren't getting water. I don't know why. Food pump's working, but I don't get why the closhes aren't getting water. Doesn't make sense. Food pipes should be transferring fluid from the fluid pump. Well, I just put this down here. I disconnected these two. They were. I mean, this was all... This one pump was supplying water to all of them full. But now I don't know what's going on.
Yeah, I have it set. <clears throat> I usually have it set up on the back. And this is where it outputs. But now it's not producing any water. Or do I gotta do it from the bottom maybe? I don't know what kind of tank to do. I don't know if I have a fluid tank. I thought I, yeah, I had one somewhere. I had this issue last stream too, I think. Yeah, basic fluid tank. Not unless I gotta just remove the pump and just... That's what we had last time, but it has power directly from the other power, so I don't... I can try. It doesn't hurt to try. Now what? Okay. Apparently that works. It's weird. Okay, now it's working, so it has to have to leave the lever on apparently, okay. I, I guess kind of makes sense. Uh, do I have enough? Oh my gosh, don't want to do that. Don't got no diamonds hardly at all. I want to upgrade the dang to diamond level, but I have very few diamonds. Might need to go mining for diamonds. It's barely enough for one block, just over a block. Okay, well, while I still wait for phantoms, let's go kill some mobs. Phantom membrane, so that's what I'm waiting on. Because I didn't know that you could actually make the plate that just kills them. That's no idea. Looks like I'm gonna have to wrap up stream pretty soon here. shows up. Hello, Mango. Ah, dang it. Okay. So, hopefully I got enough time to do that, but we'll see. All I would have to do if I get that plate is just put it right on that block and then I wouldn't have to do nothing. 
Because Siren's been super helpful all stream. I'm pretty good. I'm pretty good. Catching the tail end of stream, it looks like. Because it looks like probably just a few more minutes and i got to wrap things up. And a little bit of time. Yeah, I'm beyond for just a little bit more, it looks like, so. Maybe we'll get the phantoms and maybe I can actually get this uh, plate going. I get some of this armor with mending. I want to make some of these plates, or at least one of the plates. How's Little Mango? Little Mango's good. Little Mango's all good. Still alive. Been tempted, but still alive and well. It's nighttime, so let's go up and see. Maybe, maybe I can get some phantoms to spawn. It'd be really nice. No, I didn't ask you. I just was thanking you for your help. That's all, because you've been super helpful, Siren, all stream. So it's been really, really nice having somebody that knows quite a bit helping me. <laughs> oh, mango. Don't be saying that, Paladin. You know more than I do. here everyone here knows something better than I do so but yes you're right siren but it's nice having that helpful advice Multimeter? Okay, do what you gotta do, man. You're very right there, Mango. You are correct. back cool I think I gotta wait for one more night before I can actually get phantoms so I need fruit and sugars again
<laughs> Who needs to run die when you have a mango? I'm not gonna disagree with you on that. that. <laughs> okay, so better food. Hmm. So fruits and sugars, so... Don't have a whole lot. for go for something oh with a pickaxe interesting what yeah I died in that yeah Use a different type of pickaxe. Oh. Okay, gives me two gold chunks. I don't even think about it, Mango. Hopefully. Suppose I could actually do I still have let's do just do a bunch of berries for fruit. figure out some kind of good sugar substitute. Oh, pumpkin pie. Got lots of that downstairs. Cake. Don't have eggs, I don't think. So we've done the yucca cake, right? Yeah. And that did well. Passion fruit sorbet, and then craze ice. Jaffa cake, bar of chocolate, cocoa beans, milk. Yeah, let's do that. Pretty sure we have cocoa beans. Do I not? And all kernels. Hmm. I swear I thought I had some. I do. Cool. Now I just need jungle logs. There we go. And we'll 
place the jungle logs down and grow some cocoa beans. I still have it. I just started a brand new one. Just wanted to start fresh. Nothing wrong with it. I just thought we'd do something different. Another one, that's all. Plenty of cocoa beans and basically a renewable source now. There we go. Cool. And we can put those back in here for now. We don't really need the blackberries or the bone meal right now. Actually, let's just make this really quick, shall we? Just so we can make a... I'm trying to make something, can't remember now. A couple pieces of sugar cane. Or chocolate, I believe, is what we're trying to make. Chocolate bar, right? Oh, we need a bucket of milk. That's very simple. We're gonna make, we're gonna get one more bucket and make another one so we can use it in something else. chocolate sure empty bucket chocolate cake okay chocolate pie um, used in something right yeah epic Oreo would be amazing chocolate cake right oh but we need a fruit an orange hmm it's from Sunday. I'm a candy. There we go. So just two pieces of sugar. And that'll work for me. We can make some candy. There, now we have two different types of sugar that we can eat. Once we do get hungry, which that may be a little bit, but in the meantime, let's go kill ourselves some mobs again, shall we? I thought there would have been a lot more down here, my gosh. Apparently not. Wait for a bunch more to spawn, I suppose. Whoa, where'd you come from? Like, what? Where'd that zombie come from? I don't see no spawnable spaces here. I don't see no place for it to spawn. It's very odd. Hammer's getting slowly repaired, thankfully. What time of day is it? It is. It's getting closer to night. So the closer it gets to night, the better we're gonna be. Uh, better off we'll be. We'll fight off a bunch of phantoms. Hopefully, get a bunch of membranes. Hopefully. 
should probably trade all this away to clerics too once we get some blazer on. I don't know why I keep thinking they're going to be spawning behind me. Okay, it's getting very close to nighttime, which is good for us. Please. See, I probably could, like, AFK right here and they'd still spawn. Be willing to bet. Up top, and let's see if we'll be able to take on some phantoms. Be really nice to get a few membranes, get a few of those plates. Make sure we're up high enough in the world so they'll actually spawn. Okay, hey, you. You get some rest, and I'll catch you in the next one. You get some rest, Mango. Thank you for stopping in and saying hi. Thank you very much, Mango. Have a good one. Mr. Skeleton, I see you. Right, they should spawn. It's been two or this will be the third night I haven't slept. Chocolate bar. Hey, we gained a heart. Cool. Oh, don't tell me I have to wait another full night. That definitely sucks. Or do I just kind of like stay still for them to spawn? That I don't know. Well, dang it, I was hoping they would spawn, gosh darn it. Dang, that sucks. Because they should spawn, right? Hmm. Not sure. All the other mobs are spawning. be three full nights without sleep that's that must be the case well dang so it must mean the following night that they'll spawn well gosh darn it Turkey egg, right? We'll take it. We can use it. There's the waystone. Okay, well, unfortunately, I'm gonna have to wrap up stream regardless, so, gotta go get some food. So, I'm gonna wrap up stream here, and I'm gonna see if we can't find somebody to raid. 
Thank you everybody for hanging around and stopping in and whatnot. See if we can't find somebody here to raid real quick. Let's see here. Let's see, I maybe go here. Yep, we'll do that. Okay, well, thank you everybody, and I'll send you off on the raid. You guys have a good one. I'll catch you in the next stream. Bye-bye. See what?